Hi guys, how are you doing today? I hope you guys are having a great day. Today is a great day for us because we are going back to school clothes shopping for a teenager. So yes, Aaron is a junior now in high school. So we're about to walk into this high price Macy store. <laughs> and I do think that the prices are ridiculous. But anywho, this is where he chose to go. So uh, I'm going to have the volume turned down, you guys. So you'll have to just enjoy some of the music and I'll do a voiceover when I can because I don't want to get copyrighted uh, from YouTube. So this is one of those things. But anyway, please enjoy the video and I'll see you guys. Talk to you later. Guys, we're trying to find the men's section. Getting lost in this store. Hey, hey, babe. Hey, hey, friend. Hey, 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 who? Hey, people. <laughs> hey, people. Hey, friend. <laughs> In this clip here, I'm just talking about how I miss 
when my daughter was a little girl, you know, you, you go to the store and you can pick out what you want, you know, for the little ones because they'll wear just about anything you buy. But now, you know, when they become teens, those of you who have teens, you know how it is. Right here, I'm admiring my husband in those cute little hats that he's trying on. Just letting him know that he's handsome to me, even though he doesn't feel like he is. But we're just kind of goofing off and <laughs> having a little fun right there. And we're just, you know, I'm just browsing through looking at some of the shirts, you know, while Aaron decides where he's going to go to pick out some clothes. So that's what's happening. We're all laughing and goofing off. <laughs> And being clumsy. Okay, guys, we have finished shopping. Aaron got all that he's going to get. So we are heading on out the door, getting ready to go home. And then I will show you guys all the things that he got. Bye, Macy's. Aaron is behind the wheel driving to go home, so we thought we'd let him go ahead and take a stroll because he's been asking, can I drive, can I drive, can I drive? So we said, okay, we'll let you drive. Just drive safe. <laughs> I think he has one more month before he can apply to get his driver's license, but I'm still nervous. Oh boy, I'm still nervous. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna first start off with his backpack that he picked up. We got this backpack from Burlington's. I have went in there recently about uh, some weeks back and I saw that they had some nice backpacks. And I was considering grabbing one for him, but I thought to myself, oh, no, you know you better not do that because he is not going to want something that, you know, mom picked out. <laughs> you know how kids are. They're particular just like we can be. But anywho, this is the backpack that he picked up, and this is by Adidas. We went through so many backpacks. I kid you not. Just like girls do they can't figure out which ones they want vice versa I mean it was a mess so but this is the final one and as you can see it's just black and white he has a zipper here and it's a nice deep pocket and excuse the noise outside I don't know if you guys hear um, a motorcycle going by but these kids are on this little bike motorcycle bike and they're driving me crazy it's getting on my nerves but I hope you don't hear it so I'll try to talk a little louder when they come through okay moving right along he has a pocket on the side and I really am happy that he chose this uh, let me switch hands this is very deep very very deep it goes all the way across over here really nice and it's uh, very good for the weather water resistant zip that up and let's see then let me see is there a pocket over here I think there is I believe there is see it would have been nice if Aaron had have uh, done this haul but like I said you know how teens are they don't want to be bothered with that especially a boy 
moms are always into stuff like that. So I was like, hey, I gotta show my my family and friends what we got for you. All right, here's a zipper here. And I'm trying to do this with one hand, so bear with me. Let's see. I know that motorcycle is getting on my nerves. Okay. I don't have it quite open yet. Okay. It's a lot of space in there, and it's dark, so you really can't see how it is, but... Trust me, it's very deep. Let me see if it has, this is a pocket. Yeah, this is an extra pocket right here. Can you guys see that good? Yeah, little pocket here. I guess it's like put something right in here and there's one right here. And then there's another zipper. So I don't even know if he, if he saw that. I'm not gonna zip it, but it goes across here. Slide something down in there. Then here's another one over here. It's like, oh wow. Put some stuff over here. This is great. Also, let me see. Okay, that's just mesh. I thought it was a pocket. He does have a pocket for his water bottle, thank God, because uh, look at that. That is so nice. It's so deep. Really nice. I was on him about getting one with a um, pocket. There was some that he picked out. He was so gung-ho about getting that did not have eventually listened to me. So I'm like, mm-hmm, see. But anyway, this is it. Really nice straps for the shoulders. Kind of thick, comfortable. Kind of has the adjustable belt there. But he's the kind of team that wants to go to the most expensive stores like Macy. And I'm thinking, boy, please, <laughs> who has Macy's money? But I told him, if you go to Macy's, don't think you're going to come out with bags and bags. you just not. So he did not come out with bags and bags. But this is just a sweat shirt. L.A. Dodgers. Long sleeve. Has two pockets here. One here. And one there, super cute, it has the strings and a hood. I'm glad it has a hood because, you know, when it's cold and things like that, put, you know, put it over the head. Next sweatshirt, it's a blue one, LA. Now I'm not sure if this is LA, this is pertaining Dodgers, I'm not sure. Don't quote me. But anyway, <laughs> you see it. Two pockets here. Really nice. Long sleeve. And this one has a hoodie as well. So, this one is really nice. He tried all these clothes on and showed us how they looked last night. And he looked really handsome in it. This is a really nice shirt, you guys. It's velvet. And you probably can't tell the color it probably comes off as a different color tone of blue and gray this probably looks gray to you but it's not it's like a um, this is a darker blue and this is more of a um, I'm not sure the, the color but it's blue but it does look gray on camera and they have buttons it's velvet here really nice nice collar long sleeve shirt Really, really nice. Now, on to the little t-shirts. He picked up this cute white t-shirt. Ooh, I wish these people outside would stop. Getting on my nerves. I don't know what this is supposed to be, but it's F. I'm not sure what that is. And a K. Um, something on here on the tag. Flax head. Oh, Flag head. Okay, well, I guess that's what it is. All right, just a regular collar, round collar t shirt. The next shirt, Guess. Now, I like Guess clothes. I really do. He picked out, he's got expensive taste like his mother. <laughs> I 
My husband can vouch for that, I tell you, because when we went to pick up my wedding ring, oh boy, mm, my husband said, wow, you really got some good expensive taste. Now, this is not a 3X, uh, in case you see that. He is not a big boy. He's more of a, you know, he's taller than me, but he's slim, and it has the guest symbol there. Now, he picked up picked up a few pans. This one here, the white one. Just a simple, plain, they're kind of like jeans. Yeah, these are jeans. Comes all the way down. Nothing super duper. That's just how it looks. So one pair of white jeans. Another pair of white pants. These, I don't know what type, I guess you call this more in the sportswear, more like a um, sweatsuit, sweatpants type thing, but I like the draw, draw strap, draw strings, <laughs> draw strap, draw strings for tying, and the cute little zipper here, it says Echo, Echo somebody, but zipper here. And he loves the gold line over here. The little trim there. I said, yeah, it's nice. I told him, I said, picked out some really cute pants. Next, blue jeans. Now these, I think these are called, I'm not sure now, stone washed jeans. It says Steve's jeans, stretch jeans. I don't know but they look like kind of stone wash, you know, faded color right in this area. And I'm just thankful that he is not the type of team that wants to have all those holes. I'm like, oh gosh, please don't buy no whole jeans all cut up, showing the thighs and all that. We would not have let him buy it anyway. We would have said, no, I'm sorry, you're going too far. If you want holes in your jeans, they have to be something small and decent. And they do have some jeans like that. I, I would be okay with that. I'm pretty sure his dad would be too, just as long as they're not really big. These, this is the best pair of pants that he picked up. And I have to say, I like them myself. These are, they're kind of like jeans, but they're leather. Leather jeans has two pockets, one pocket here, one pocket there. There's a place for the belt. And look at this, I love, there's a singer that kind of wore pants similar to this style. Check out the little cute zipper on the side. I think that is so nice. I'm talking about this part. There's a very popular singer. Um, I should just tell you, cause somebody might not type it down in the comments, but I'll just tell you, Michael Jackson, yes. Aaron loves Michael Jackson. Who doesn't? Okay, he got a Coca-Cola t-shirt. Cute, cute. Nothing on the back. Now here's a nice shirt. This is very interesting uh, the way it's designed, but I think it's really handsome. It's a cute shirt. Red and black with the pocket right there. Super cute. And look at the... Um, the sleeves and on top of the shirt over here. That's really nice. Here's another guest shirt. Super cute. I love the gold on the front of it. And it's just plain on the back. Nothing super duper. Got that in a small. Most of his shirts are small because he likes everything to be form fitting. So, okay. Here we go with Michael Jackson. He finally found a Michael Jackson t shirt. It's just a simple shirt that says the king of pop. It's actually a cute shirt. You know, I don't see anything wrong. Another tee. This is red. And I don't know what this, this uh, saying is. It's MC, M-X-C-I-V. I don't know what that is, but I just hope it's nothing crazy. <laughs> it's plain on the back. A simple shirt, short sleeve. Next, another t shirt. It's 
seemed like that's all he got was t-shirts, but it's not really a t-shirt, it's more of a shirt because it has a design to it. But this is by Mark, Mark Echo, whoever he is. <laughs> but that's how it looks, and it's plain on the back. This is now, Calvin Klein is in the house, as you can see. Just a simple white t-shirt, short sleeve, and that's pretty much it. Nothing on the back, just plain. Got a pair of guest tennis shoes, I guess you would call these tennis shoes. They're just shoes. <laughs> these are really cute. I never saw any shoes like this before. Yes, by Los Angeles or something like that. But anyway. And the next pair of shoes is just a plain white. Uh, I don't know what you call these type of shoes. I'm just calling them tennis shoes. <laughs> but this is how it looks on the side. And I was saying to him, why do you get all this white? White, white, white. And you know how white is, it's gonna get all dirty. But that's what he wants, so that's what he picked out. Now, some school supplies. Oh boy, here we go. We're just starting out with some four packs of paper, because you know, this is not gonna last throughout the whole year, but it's just to start him off. So he's got four packs of those. It has 100 sheets in each pack. And then he picked up some pens. I guess these are, I guess these are gel pens. Yeah, gel pens right here. And it has assorted colors. He's got two packs of Sharpies, one in the three pack and one in the two pack. I guess because this one is ultra fine. Yeah, this one's ultra fine and this one's fine. So that's that. And then he got a big pack of regular pens. It's 40 in a pack. And I think they have the yeah, eraser on top. These are called mechanical pins. So. And last but not least, a binder. He chose red because he loves the color red. That's how it looks on the back. These binders are kind of expensive, you guys. Shoot. I call them expensive, they're not, they're not cheap. And this is really nice because it has a lot of, uh, it has a three ring binder. I mean, it's a three, that's what it is, a three ring binder. And it has three inch capacity, five color tabs, expanding file, handle and shoulder strap. A U zipper for easy access. So let's see what it looks like. Wow, it's nice. You've got your big strap. This is neat because the one he had last year, it did not have a shoulder strap. I think this is really nice. I guess that Velcro separates, closes up this area over here. Oh, this is the area where he has... Um, his little files, his little, um, what do you call those things? Uh, I'll just say file, shoot. I can't think of what it's called, the little dividers, yeah. So he has room to put stuff in the dividers, which is, I think is really neat. He's got one, two, three, four, five. Something tells me he's gonna need an, an additional pack to go in here. Well, anyway, he is all set for school, I tell you. So I hope you guys have enjoyed watching this haul. If you have enjoyed this haul, please give me a big thumbs up. Tell me what you think. And, um, yes, yeah, summer, summer school, he passed, thank God. He had to take that um, health health class over and he passed it he aced it with an a plus thank god i was like "Woo, yes i'm so glad you passed which i'm you know i knew he would but i was just kind of a little nervous but got to get prepared for graduation so you got to pass it but anyway you guys i hope you have enjoyed this haul this is a teenage haul for a boy 
and I thank you guys so much for tuning back in and watching this video and um, try to stay cool and I will talk to you guys later bye bye